out of, I mean, Zelda is not considered to be a great character in this game. Yeah. But oh my goodness, I think she is really scary in the yeah, in a lot of so situations. Scary. Like with the night out, it just yeah. feels like you're really pressured to do something. Alo really showing out why what yeah. this character can do. Alo just knows like how to capitalize off of what you want to do and when you want to do it and what options you choose to do. Like such confidence coming out from Alo and the edge guards, the side bees are on point. Yeah. I actually like that we're gonna see Xavier Straw Hat coming up soon. Yeah, and this will be for fourth place, I believe. It is loser semifinal. You have another Mario Seth? Mario Seth or Mario Young Link? I, I think Mario, Seth Mario Seth seems like a double edged sword for me. Um, because I think like, Straw has been playing a lot of Sephiroth. Yeah, so, I think so. I think I think we're gonna be seeing some Sephiroth. Here. Yeah, it does feel like a double edged sword matchup because I imagine there's a lot of situations where Seth can keep Mario out, and it's like oh he's getting and the counter on the recovery. I also think should be pretty good. Um, but at the same time, like. Sephiroth's like range that he boxes people out is very horizontal. If he wants to commit to the up air, it's like really committal and like think, really slow. I think so. he might employ the same strategy since that's Weezy, where he puts the side B on Mario to make sure he can't get into the combos. Stop, but what? Disrupt, disrupt his combos with the side B, you know? Yeah. Well, I will say Mario's got the cape one. That's, that's dangerous. That's and dangerous. the most a frequent complaint from Sephiroth mains is that if you're really close to Sephiroth, actually, the side B is. Yeah. If I recall, I think Xavier Sephiroth. actually puts Strong having losers. What? I think Xavier put Strawhead in losers. I think. The losers? I think so. This is losers. No, Stra Xavier put Strawhead in losers. What? Xavier put Strawhead in losers. Oh, put him in losers. Yeah. Okay. I think so. I think I think these two have already. Played. Uh, and I think I did see the cape on the. I think I did see cape. Let me make sure I'm not tripping. Sure I think he played both Young Link and Sephiroth in that winner's match, if I recall. But now we are seeing the Sephiroth out. Yeah, he did. He did. Yeah. And the orbs are already out. They played. Yeah. Yahoo! Yeah. He's really good with Shawhead. I think he started doubling Blast Smash. Oh, that's right. I think he got hit those out here. Play Sephiroth here. Oh, a big Mario combo coming Big out Mario here. moment. Ooh. Oh. Wow. Yeah, Sephiroth is really light, too. Yeah, he's that's true. Wow, there's oh, a cape coming out. Oh my goodness, that, that is a lot that of is orbs. Oh, he, he just said, I'm out of here. <laughs> oh my, shield damage. Did you see that shield damage? Yeah. The five orbs itself almost broke his shield. Oh, Sephiroth looks yeah. very composed, but I guarantee you, he was losing he was his shit right he was there. Scared. He was He, he was actually so just played dash to the other oh side of the stage. Send. Ooh, send down, down smash. smash. Hey, with the wig, you can. You can send down smash. Oh. I, think, I think you really just wanted to... Get that angle, maybe you can poke out Xavier. Ten. Ten. It does not matter if I float, but I must send down Smash. And there we go. No, I hit, I hit a sweet spot there. I won't close out. Oh, oh no. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. That was that death. Would have that would have killed him. Ah, not getting the kill out of time. Oh my, that was death in carnival. In general, I think that Giga Flare is risky because oh, yeah. even though it covers a lot of space, um, it's very laggy. Unlike against any character, but against Mario especially, yeah, you gotta watch out. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh. try to hit the Aqua Slash. Yeah, Ox that was really good. Even text slice. Yeah. Even if you miss it, you know, it's still pretty safe. It yeah. Is, it is a dash. That's a force. Yeah. Forbes even the, the air dodge there, pushing off stage. Fair. Ooh. Tries to intercept okay. with the Octo Slash going yeah. up, which is intercepting the Octo Slash the other way is really cool. Yeah. I don't know what happened there. That's a little unfortunate. Mm -hmm. Alright, some unfortunate happenings in this set, but. Octo Slash is really great with the uh, reversing, you know? If you, if yeah. you place the other direction. If yeah, it sends horizontally. Yeah. If, you, if you reverse the Octo Slash to make sure it does, it's really good. Oh, that's dead. That's my problem. See, that also is something yeah. that might be really rough for Seth up in the matchup, though, is that if he gets Mario, he kind of dies before he gets wind, and that's huge. And it's really tough for Sephiroth, too, because he's really yeah. tall. He can get hit by a lot of, like, Mario's favorite options, oh, yeah. like, rising up and rising back here, rising here. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, oh what? <laughs> okay, I knew it, like, scales with jump, but I didn't moves. think he would literally be in the top blast zone. Went to the moves. <laughs> Oh boy, that's a lot of damage. Oh, no. looking. What that says, I want out of there. Yeah. He does not want to be there. Oh, oh no. that cape again with the orbs. Yeah, and even if he doesn't fully charge him, you know, the, the cape does multiply the orbs. Mm -hmm. So even if you have a weak, weak side, you, know, you might get three yeah. or four orbs on him. Yeah, I feel like minimum he gets three orbs. Yeah. But we do have wing on deck here, so it might. Oh, oh wow. Really caught his recovery with the water there. Yeah, so that's the dangers of using Octo Slash. It doesn't really grab ledge immediately, it only grabs at the end of the move there. 
I'm really surprised you're charging he, it up. I'm really surprised he did get the water there. I guess his head was po I guess Sephiroth's head was poking a little bit much there. Allowed him to yeah. push him off. Yeah. A lot of times I see Sephiroth's like arc slash the ledge, they're parallel. So, you know, the hitbox isn't above, but the arc slash box is still like way above the ledge. Yeah. Really great space, really great, really great stuff with Xavier there. Yeah, really good awareness yeah. as well. Great awareness. No, like, I feel like as soon yeah. as he starts charging the Octo Slash, that's when Xavier knows that he can go for Cave. Like, he has ample time to react and do it. So, right, hey, this like, is good even, awareness. Even if he does charge Octo Slash, you know, he can just react to the charge and just... Whatever. Yeah, and he's exactly. Charged, oh, I mean, true, true. While he, he's in charge. He might not even make it to yeah, the ledge. He doesn't yeah. even make it to the ledge. You just flood him from anywhere. When he's dead. Oh, so now Straw's getting Never serious. Wrong. He's taking the shirt off. Oh, boy. The shirt that's how you know. Except for ain't serious. playing around anymore. He's serious. He's crashing Mario's game. Alright. Well, uh, mm, okay. Uh, uh, Smashville, <laughs> pretty aggressive stage. Smashville and immediate send F smash. That's how it is. Send F smash. Send. Ooh, up throw, fair. Or up throw, nair, sorry. Wow. Pushing really good pairs. Wow, Ooh, that counter. counter. That counter's what we're talking we're seeing about. Seeing it here. cash in. Yeah, there Action we go. That counter there, oh my pushing goodness. Off stage, taking the quick seconds. Stock. Yeah. Wow, 20 seconds stock there. Oh, that oh, or You saw the orb. Right yes. yes. 1 0 shot. Wait. No. No. 1 0 Xavier. 1 0 Xavier. 1 0 Xavier. Yeah. Xavier's really going for these fairies here. Yeah. It, it feels like a. Oh my gosh. I drag down down or the F smash? I don't think I've ever seen Mario drag down down air. I, mean, I don't think it leads into anything it true, but it puts you in like a peculiar... Well, a awkward situation. You just don't yeah. expect to be there. So it's very you're, peculiar. Trying to get ready, you're trying to get ready to play the down air minigame. You're not ready for it. Oh, that shield? Ooh, that shield. You better watch out for that shield. That shield is... If you know... If, if the shield is low, do you know what that means you might be able to do? Then down, down smash. smash. Yeah. Oh, or oh, just wow. shield poke with the bear. bear. Yeah. Shield poke with the bear. Close, closing out the stock right here. Uh, oh, that dash yeah. up smash. I think Sean's really showing a lot of adaptation here because you know, he was really getting caught up by Xavier's combos here. Yeah. I, I don't think Xavier's barely hit any combo. I should really stop talking. Yeah. <laughs> but they were really shutting out that combo. Like we were talking about before. That nair, ooh, landing with that nair is dangerous. It's a little bit yeah, risky for Sephiroth. It's Sephiroth's. a little risky, but you know, Sephiroth yeah. can get uh, nair bear. Ooh, air dodging through that up tilt, really good. Push him, push him, Gabe, oh, that wow. counter That's lasting. Oh, wow. Tight edge guard. Tight edge guard. That's another game coming something. out. Yeah. You're seeing a lot of counter pressure with that game. This adaptation just yeah. seems insane. Like, I think between games, something just clicks, and then the next game, it's like a completely different player. It's I, I feel crazy. like Straw Hat is like learning when mm. Xavier wants to go in. He's throwing out counter, retreating fair, bear. Yeah. He's really catching his jump ins and just pushing them off stage, and then capitalizing off of. Happening off and being off stage, like pushing him off with fair, reverse yeah. off slash fair. Yeah. He's really keeping Mario at range and keeping, making sure he stays off stage in the situation too. Mm -hmm. And what's Mario's off stage? He's, I think he's being a little more careful with his side view usage. Yeah, usage getting caped is good, but you still yeah. see him capitalizing off yeah. of it. Definitely using side view really shape. The shirt came off. It, it did. Is it still off? Yes, it, it is. still off. It's like light to the extreme here. You know? He doesn't roll up his sleeves, he takes off the shirt. Just whip it. That's an extra power. Two, one, go. Hey, game three. three PS2. Nice that's still catching rolling. That F tilt just literally feels like it just butchers the player in half. They should just like be dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh definitely playing definitely keeping his range a little keep his range a little more. Uh, it's not very, it's not just like the horizontal options. I think the landing uppers are very like cheeky coming out from Straw Hat. Because they're catching a lot of jump, they're really great at yeah. catching catch jump. Oh yeah. It's a huge move, huge Yeah, huge move. Oh, wow. Very high commitment, but super huge. That could have been very a huge good. conversion for Xavier, basically. Now it's not on the shield getting Ah, uh, waits for the air dodge. Grab from it. It's out of it. Okay. I think one thing I've ever seen. Backers are really nice. Send down smash. Uh, right there, honestly, great position to stop. Yeah. Covers a lot of options, got the words on him. There's a lot of pressure, could break shield. Draw Hat just wants Xavier off his stage now. Yes. Yeah, this I is mean, my you stage. do not want to give up center against Mario either. You don't. I think center stage is perfect for Mario to do his combos. You know, the pop up is perfectly dialed for Mario to do a lot. General rule of thumb of Smash if you have center, don't, don't give it up. Keep the match. Wow! Wow! Cutting through the, the fireball, the fireball, and the Mario. but. <laughs> ooh, ooh. 
I, I saw that flood out. Flood. I was a little I'm still thinking about it. Still thinking about it. I would be hesitant for going for a horizontal Ooh. one. Again. Oh my goodness! Oh, wow, that, that was huge. almost the. I've never had the foot so send send down smash. Down smash. The armor is really coming in clutch here. Yeah. It, the armor seems like some of the, one of those things that Sephiroth players like forget about sometimes, or that their opponents forget about. Like, oh, who really cares that he has armor on wing? But no, it against oh. like stuff like fireball. It's really good. Send, 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 send. The shield is looking tiny. It was. Oh. Run up, mm. run up, up smash, very classic, closing out the stock. And we're even. Didn't let Charlotte, didn't let Charlotte get that much extra set it, so it was pretty good to do. Yeah. Ooh, that was a really good orb to hit him on the platform. That was excellent. And the, these down smashes... The down smashes are really great because... Even so good, yeah! The down smashes are really great because especially when he has auras on him, he just really can't shield, so he kind of just has to eat them. Yeah, and even if, if he shields, he can't punish, and his shield becomes really low. And he had the orbs on right there, too. Yeah, this is just a lot. Wow, just, just fireball. Just shields and options. Oh, almost catches the roll into the bubble. Whenever you upper. see them waiting like that, oh you were boy. talking about it earlier. Rising upper is really a great option. Uh -huh. It's just how tall Sephiroth is. Yeah, it'll hit him. Oh, it will definitely hit him. That air? Oh, oh, he had it. He, too. Had it. he did have it. Just a little bit off he on the really time. He is really on point with his speed. I feel like he knows exactly yeah. when he wants to roll in here. Mario yeah. players got mad confidence once they start yeah. blowing, man. Ah, uh, the air dodge not able to get away from those orbs. Orbs looking really scary. Here. Almost mm. got caught. Your battle. I think Sephiroth wins low key, but Xavier in it. I mean, it depends on closer, you know? That's yeah, true. It's a really slow backer, Mario backer, off. Mario backer is not moves. slow. Not fair. That's a, that's a that move. That move is a crime. That was a really nice up smash to catch the landing, though, by Xavier. I think Xavier's doing a lot of counter damage. He's really finding his way in. So I think yeah. Strahd does want to keep him out, but Xavier is finding openings to get in. Running up shield is a great option for him. Yeah. So he can shield, catch Sephiroth landing with the, with the aerials. And like that, right there. Wow, it's a really good run-up crap. Yeah. yeah. Run-up run up shield is doing wonders for Xavier. But... Got kill? Not yet, not and yet, he's got yet. wing. He does have wing. If he takes the stock, he can make a lot of use out of wing. Here. He gets the yeah. stock really soon. And he needs the stock very soon. Yeah. Oh. Really soon. Smash. If he takes Ooh. a little 1%, he's going to be enough smash to kill range. Yeah. Send Send. Even at this percent, send you gotta it. send it. This percent, you gotta no send it. No fear, send down smash. Xavier getting, Xavier finding his way in. Yeah. Wow. Oh, good Xavier trump, but no, nothing off it. Oxlash uh, covering, make sure he doesn't, make sure Xavier can't get anything off that. Mm. That up air from Sephiroth is gonna be really slow. Sephiroth Straw really cannot find this kill here. He really needs yeah. to kill really soon if he wants to make it. And it feels here. like a lot of Sephiroth's moves can kill, but he's not just finding the right opportunities because Xavier isn't giving it to him. He also has to think about losing wings soon if he keeps going up. So yeah. He, he would really love to have Wings. Oh, that bear there, finally yeah. gonna poke through oh, yeah. shield. He's definitely keeping his range at ledge here. He really wants to get these orbs. Oh, oh. that's what we're talking about. Yeah. Those horizontal blade dashes, Xavier's doing a really good job of keeping, uh, stuffing that much blood, making sure he can't really come back up there and do a free fall. Yeah. He's going to be for the Mario in here. Yeah. Yeah, these horizontal blade dashes, really catching them. Really aware of when he wants to do it. Horizontal blade dash, or blade dash in general, feels like sometimes it could be a decent escape option for Sephiroth or movement option, but if you catch onto it, yeah. then you're good it's at punishing really it. Yeah. It's, no, it's no Pikachu quick attack. It's no quick attack. Not quite. Not quite. Not quite. But, you know, can catch people, some, some people off guard. And, you know, I've really never seen anyone punish Sephiroth and cover you this much. You know, Oxlash seems like... Whenever you see Oxlash, you're like, all right, man, I gotta run back on stage, you know? But yeah. Xavier's doing a really good job of just giving him out. Yeah, know? like, Mario isn't, like, Pyro, all right? You yeah. can't just be like, oh, Octo Slash, uh, I'll beat yeah. it out. Like, yeah. Mario Maybe doesn't have that. stubby hands, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I'm really surprised that he's really doing a great job. He's making it work with the Flood. He's really yeah. making sure that he, you know, water, you know, he, water does beat out Octo Slash. Well. Yeah. I mean, he Mario has tools, it's hard, but he does have tools to counter the recovery. And Sephiroth's recovery is, like, very tricky Sephiroth. for some characters to deal tricky, with. Yeah, yeah. But it has weaknesses for sure. Absolutely. It's a game four, right? Game four. One, two, three, three. Ooh. One he almost, catch in on that S. Did, he did have the air dodger, so he was all on the box second. Alright. Ooh! That was almost huge. 
Wow, all, he, he does he knows exactly when Shohai wants to do this horizontal vertical throughout the flood. Shohai did have the spacing that time, make sure he could not go hit the there. Yeah. Oh wow. Shohai is really being forced to play at close range. No, he's really not being able to get these like space fairs, space fairs here. They're usually getting up in the space and making it hard for the Shrahai to run away. Oh, wow. He did get the cave. Shrahai did a little... Lapping it off, yeah. Yeah. Forehead, right? yeah. yeah. In that situation, you gotta reset your mind as yeah. fast as possible. Make nothing of it. No, just keep it going. Keep it going. was nothing. I did not die at it. But that was percent. a great cave. What? That was a fantastic cave. David's really showing that he can really do it. With a oh, really good grab right there from Xavier. Yeah. Uh, to punish that Octo Slash. Really nice stuff. Yeah. Good stuff coming out here. What's up, dead? Wow. He wants him dead right now. Sometimes it's not just about the kill, it's about sending a message. It's not going to work on him. Oh, he's trying to get the throw invincibility. That was a great yeah. That was actually a good idea. Our backer has so much in this world. Like, three orbs still going to be enough to yeah, hit him at the end. Wow! Yeah, yeah. That's what we're talking about. Perfect! Yeah. Oh, off save, box splash, covering the recovery option, setting the board on. Yeah. He does have wing. He can make something work. He can make something work. Oh, that's no, no jump. jump. No jump. Ooh. I'm really not. So, I'm, I'm surprised we're not seeing more of these counters or downers. Counter, like, yeah. Set oh, like down those, smash. Those great. There's a counter. Ah. Uh, Unfortunate counter. Is that what you wanted? Not that counter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure that's I'm still thinking about it. Oh, oh no. no. Uh, <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Sephiroth panic. Oh, oh man. 49. 50%. You know if the cape makes the orb stronger as well. That's it broken. Goes. If it like increases, oh, oh. Good after after the day, yeah. Dave, you're just having. Oh, oh and my again. gosh. Probably laughing it off, but yeah. Yeah, but that Xavier, great. That last two stock. Two the two yeah. there. That last stock, Xavier just. Yeah. I, he, I everything think he's, down pat. He's really capitalizing off Draw doing his horizontal recoveries. You know. Mm -hmm. he's really yeah. Making, yeah. And it's also the like very close to ledge when he started charging it. A lot of Sephiroths do like to do it close to ledge because then 